on Chinese social media, a never-before-seen red flag series of anti-aircraft missiles has attracted a lot of attention. It bears similarities to the Russian S-350 medium and long-range air defense missile and is probably the most advanced Chinese air defense missile aimed primarily at this distance category. In the video, the missile's launch vehicle is seen driving through a busy city. It uses an 8x8 truck chassis and is believed to have good off-road capability. The vehicle carries four sets of 12 missile tubes in total, which are expected to be launched vertically. It has a few hydraulic stands to ensure the stability of the vehicle when launching missiles. It may have a modular design, allowing reloading missile tube modules swiftly. The vehicle as a whole is similar to the HQ-16 air defense missile system currently in service, but carries a smaller missile, doubling the number of missiles. In the video, the tail structure of the missile launcher closely resembles the same part of the Russian S-350. The S-350 is Russia's newest medium and long-range air defense missile, and a vehicle can carry 12 missiles. The S-350 has a set of three missile tubes lined up side by side, the Chinese missile's arrangement has a delta shape. This is one of the major visual differences of the two. If the two systems are indeed related to each other, China and Russia may have cooperated on this project. It is worth noting that at the 2022 Zhuhai Air Show, several models of all new Chinese air defense missiles were on display, including the new Red Flag missile, similar to the Patriot PAC-3 long-range anti-missile, Red Flag 16FE, and Red Flag 11. I will make a few videos about them, please subscribe to my channel to get the latest information. Obviously, we don't know the details of this Chinese missile, so let's focus on the performance of the Russian S-350 missile. It is a mobile multi-channel medium-range surface-to-air missile system, designed to replace earlier versions of the famous S-300 missile system. It was built on a relatively inexpensive truck chassis, and eventually its technology was transferred to South Korea, which developed the KMSAM air defense missile system, which is said to have anti-missile capability. In 2021, the S-350 was finally unveiled in Russia and put on public display. The S-350 can attack aircraft, cruise and ballistic missile targets. It has a phased array radar vehicle and a command vehicle. The S-350 system can combat 16 airborne or 12 ballistic missile targets simultaneously. The maximum attack distance is 60 kilometers and the maximum attack altitude is 30 kilometers. It fills the gap between Russia's medium and long-range air defense missiles. Again, we cannot confirm at this time whether China's latest red flag air defense missile is related to the S-350, but we can confirm that it is an entirely new weapon system, with no obvious connection to known Chinese air defense missiles. Thanks for watching, and again please subscribe, share and comment. Thank you.